Corey Trepanier's Into the Arctic Video Journals. Brought to you in part by Eureka for Life Outdoors. And by Merrill. Let's get outside. Well, we're hiking along the uh, another mountain range here, up near the Firth River, and uh, weather hasn't been cooperating the best with us. This morning we had uh, fog after a beautiful clear night last night when we really thought that we had a, a chance at a beautiful clear morning and a sunrise. But with the bad weather, has also come some incredible lighting through the day as it starts to clear a little bit, continues to rain. We have some patchy light that's taking place across the mountains, which is really creating some, some beautiful contrast in the scenery. These ever-changing conditions like these, it's been really, really great to have quality gear and raincoats and that are breathable and, and keep the wind and this rain out. It really allows you to, to focus on what, what you're here for with temperatures hovering above the zero mark. It's, uh, it's made a, a nice difference in being able to enjoy this outing a lot more and exploring this incredible Arctic wilderness. A little ways from camp and got a great spot to paint and uh, started to paint and sure enough just as it tends to here the weather changed yet again and it really start to blow and rain and rain and rain and, and I'm not done painting yet so I thought I'd go through the effort of pitching the tarp and it uh, looks like I'm off on my angle a bit but anyhow move my paint stuff underneath it and I keep working for a while almost there I don't know if I'll be able to see anything out of it, but at least it should keep me dry for a while. At least my paint's dry. It's just sitting over there in the rain. But it makes a huge difference. I carry it with me every time I'm painting. You just never know what the weather's going to be like. And I don't want to go home early if I'm not done. Now, bring the paint stuff under here. And I can uh, keep working for a while. There we go. Hey! Or I haven't got much room, but pretty much dry. Woo! Well, it's about midnight probably, and we're heading back to camp. And uh, as you can see from behind me, we have ourselves an enormous windstorm yet again. And we're trying to make our way back. It's uh, just howling, but uh, it's pretty invigorating in some ways. <laughs> anyway, we're going to hike across that ridge pass behind me there, and uh, back over a couple more hills, and, and hopefully we're hoping our tent is still uh, still in place too by the time we get back. That'd be nice. Ready for a little dinner finally. Anyhow, it's been quite, a, quite an, an awesome trip out here so far. Got a great spot to paint down that way. Uh, it was just beautiful. Tried to work on a little study and uh, hope to do something a little bigger from it later back home. Sorry about this way before it blows out of my hands.